Hi everybody and welcome back to the small village of Revilia, where it is still February in winter. We're still doing terrible on food. Um, we have fuel, that's nice. And we only have a few days before we have a raider attack. We were following the woman who works at the church who's supposed to be transporting the dead. But she's in charge of a food stall now. I'm a little confused by that. I thought I thought she was supposed Oh, Bandit Camp was sighted. Great. Peddling. The grave digger is peddling. There's one body buried. Lady? Where are Yeah, we've got a bit more to do. There's indeed a bit more to do. We have six days until the raider attack. That's real nice. Oh man. Alright, so what we're doing to try and plan for this raider attack is we're constructing towers. And, oh man, it takes planks. Something I didn't realize. We have another family joining, that's good. We have the stone, we have the timber. We're kind of negative in planks right now, which I didn't know was possible, but... Ah, generic storage is full. Good, good, get those planks out. We need that so bad. So we're going to try and build these towers and have our poor... Poor archers that we're rebuilding from the first Battle of Goldhof. We're rebuilding our archers. We have 16. It's not going to be enough to fend off these bandits but maybe we'll kill a few that would be nice and I don't uh, I don't understand why this lady is pedaling oh they're they're waiting I don't know what they're waiting for maybe they need something to transport the body or something but hopefully they'll take care of that and they're gonna build this beautiful monument which I put to very low priority it's not that not that important that we build it, but we do want to build it eventually. Good. So, we're waiting for four days for these raiders to attack, and then I have a plan to hopefully take care of this food problem. We're apparently going to be stuck in this little territory for a while. Eventually, we will fight in Goldhof again and take this area, because it does belong to us, and we'll have this as well. Why not? We deserve it. We deserve nice things. Ah, but until then, we're going to have to do some farming here. So one thing that I want to do straight away is I'd like to divide this field in two, if we can. Is it going to let us just delete the field? No, it won't. Here, we have to delete this field somehow. Burn it? No, I'm not sure. Demolish. Yes. Good, the field is gone. It was too big. It was just too big. I think it would be far more advantageous for us. Oh, look at this. We'll connect it to this road as well. And we'll give it just a little bit of a curve, right? Hold on. Or not. There's no curve. It's just going to be a little diagonal. <laughs> That's fine, though. Good stuff. All right, and we're going to replace this with two fields. We have wheat in this one, which is growing and stuff that's great this one was fallow so we'll do wheat on this one right here and then fallow on the other one kind of give them a bit of a rotation you know so farming gonna make some fields we'll do this one wheat perfect and we'll get another field here I know there's a way that you can put these in so that, yeah, good, it'll use that whole thing. Nice. Alright, so this one, we'll make it wheat to start. We'll do crop rotation and then fallow, and then wheat. And then this one will start at fallow, and then we'll do wheat and wheat. Nice. Awesome. And we have one day. We have one day until we get attacked. That's fantastic. Enemy unit was spotted. Alright, where are you guys at? They're all the way at the edge of the map. 
Okay, so we have time. I'm not going to pull anybody off of production yet until they're real close. Ah. Oh, we got an extra one. We're up to 18. Nice. This is not going to be finished. That's real sad. Oh, we completed a mission by having the raiders near. That's good. Look at the size of Von Butthead's army. And these guys who are attacking us, if that's it, we might survive this. I'm not sure if he's got reinforcements, but he might try and walk right through Von Butthead's army. That's not going to go well for you, dude. Are you sure you want to do this? Is this... That's your plan? Your plan is to walk through Von Butthead? I faced him once. You don't want to do it, dude. Trust me. You don't want to do it. But we have the same size. Archers are pretty terrible, though, so I please, Von Butthead. If you could get your retinue over there, look. Is it happening? Are you guys going for it? Please. You're the best. I think he is. Oh, this is... <laughs> Come on. I am so hopeful right now. Oh my goodness. Look at this. They're doing it. <laughs> Go get them, boys. Yeah. So this is what it would have looked like if they faced our archers. Let's see how well they do. Archers are turning back. Uh-oh, they're getting scared. Look at them. They're pumping their fists. Uh-oh. <laughs> and then that happened. And then that happened. And the bandits were no more. <laughs> Von Butthead strikes again. What a dude. Von Butthead. Look at, <laughs> look at these guys. They're all fist pumping. Oh, that is hilarious. I don't think there were any, uh... Yeah, they just broke, too. There were no reinforcements. That was it. I'm pretty sure that they just got seen off the field. Yeah, they're... They're running away. Alright, walled brand. It looks like... Yeah. Von Butthead is just taking all the territories. He's just taking all the stuff. Oh, look, they came back for a little bit. They're, so <laughs> they're not done. They don't like to be followed. They're like, please stop following us. We don't know how to feel about this. We're, we would like to run away, but you guys are still just following us. Please stop. All right, nice. So I think that was it for the, uh, the much feared raider attack that was going to happen. It was going to happen, but then Von Butthead happened. Oh boy. All right, so it's March. Ah, oh, look at this. It's spring. Okay, we have a lot of work to do. Homes, we have 30. And only 26 families, so we're good on homes. We have these new changes to this. I'm going to add, it's spring now. What are these people doing? Transporting, waiting, transporting. So they are doing things, which is nice. I like it when people do things. Let's add another family to this so more families do things. It'll be good. And what are we building? We're still working on this with three families. That's nice. How is... The wild animals are coming back. The berries will hopefully start growing sometime soon. I'm hoping more of these bodies will be buried as well. That's a hope of mine. Guys? transported good good they're doing their job nice so we got that going for us all right there is one thing i want to do real quick if we take a look at the fertility for emmer right it's where we built our farms up here since we're kind of locked into this tile we need to take advantage of all of this if we can so let's put some fields up here about how big was this about that size of a square we could put a nice big square right up here we're going for it we'll go right to the edge of this forest let's see about how bad how big this is if i can speak english 1.3 maybe we should make it just a little bit smaller let's try and go for the one 
We just won one whole Morgan. Oh, that was 0.9 of a Morgan. Look at that. 1.0 on the dot. Nailed it. All right, we got one right there. Oh, we can connect them too. Look at this. We're going nuts. One, uh, that's a whole nother Morgan. We did it. We're just gonna have this nice little strip. I like this, all right. I approve. We're gonna have to add a whole bunch of families. Oh, that's only 0.8 of a Morgan, I failed. There we go, another Morgan. Should we add the final one? We may as well, right? Go big or go home. Can we get a Morgan? No. Can't do it. How about now? How do you feel about a Morgan? Point 0.9! We were so close. It's like a mini game. Can you get the Morgan? We did it. We outdid ourselves. A 1.1 Morgan. Okay. And we're going to alternate these fields. So, let's see. Oh, we have to do something about the field priority as well. We'll do that before spring really starts to kick in. So for this first one, we'll go wheat, and then we'll go fallow, and then wheat. Beautiful. This one, we'll go fallow, and then wheat, and then some wheat. And then, you know, same thing. We're just going to alternate fallow and wheat. And then the final one. I forget which one we were on now. Were we on the this one's wheat as well? Christ, why is my brain so terrible? That one was wheat, so this one's gonna be fallow. There we go. Fallow and then wheat and then wheat. Yay! And I want this field is the very high priority. Because that one's actually growing wheat. Good. Nice. Alright, so we got some stuff in play. We should get a nice road have access to these fields that sounds like a good idea just run it up this side maybe I actually I want to give them a shortcut to where they these homes right here so if we do make a nice road let's get one running all along this field just following it perfectly And we'll have it connect to here. Let's try and angle it a little bit. That looks pretty nice. Nice, all right, that is good looking road, I approve. And then from up here at the very end, we wanna get up to here, so we'll go around these trees. Oh yeah the height of realism and then it'll go out this way and yeah how's that looking maybe try and get some curves on it no Ooh. that looks nice all right cool <clears throat> awesome got some roads in place uh, we have three families building. I'm gonna... What are you guys doing right now? Plowing by hand. Okay, so they're doing stuff. Okay. We're gonna get another family. Doing stuff. It's fantastic. Alright, cool. Look at all the snow going away. And how is this going along? Have we buried any more people? No. Ah. Uh. Really need you guys to get on that. There's good. There they are transporting. How far off are they? Okay, good. It's getting done. All right. Our whoa. Where'd I go? Our berries have started growing. I paused the game real quick because we need to get on food straight away. So we need to pull people from some production. So we have. First of all, we have eight months of fuel. So, woodcutter's camp, we have one working at this one. The other woodcutter's camp, 
Let's take one away from that. So we'll have one working at each. That's good. Uh, let's see. We have the logging camp. We have three families. Let's take that down by one. Uh, where else can we pull from? We don't really need the clay furnace going. We're going to take one from that. Let's see how much we can fill up this forager's hut. We kept one there, so there's one already working. We got three, and we still have two builders left. Okay, perfect. That should be good. Alright, um... We might be able to take another family away from building. I'm gonna do that right away. From building to the farmhouse, we need to get these builds going. I changed the priority so that this one is the top priority. It's... Where's the very high? There you go. Found it. And then this one is high. Since it's right next to everything, I want that one to be next. These are both fallow. Because I noticed they were, they were plowing this one by hand. Which is nice and everything. But I really want to build a house here. <laughs> Should we build a house here? I just, I feel like I need to. Hold on. We don't even have to build it straight away. I just feel like this deserves to have a house at this very corner, right? To kind of pull everything together. Here, let's go from this corner. It'll be a big home, too. It's going to be a big one. Lucky family is going to live here. One home. Right on the corner. I love it. Perfect. Alright, good. And this one, we'll put that on low priority. Not all too important that we make that. But it would be nice. All right, cool. I would. Uh, I do want more families for these farms, though. Um, we could. We don't really need clay, right now. I'm gonna pull off a clay, and I'm gonna continue gathering stone. We're gonna need some of that for construction. I'm probably gonna stop selling it as well. Yeah, let's do that. We'll put this extra family to farming as well. And, yeah, things are starting to look up. If we can get these fields done, harvest this wheat, which should be... Yeah, look at that. It's half grown already. Oh, boy. If we can get this sorted, get food sorted, we'll be able to rebuild ourselves very well and build ourselves an army yet again. Oh, it's going to be good. I made some more small changes. I pulled a lot of people from logging and all that other stuff. There's only room for one more family at the farm that we just don't have an extra person yet. And it looks like we are burying some more of our fallen comrades. People are real sad about it. Ah, real unfortunate. It looks like there is one little grave marker per person that's deceased. I wonder what happens when it's all full up. Oh man. Yeah, things are looking pretty good. We should start getting berries in, which is real nice. Get some food in, and we have tons of farmers plowing these fields by hand, so... Uh, things are looking up. We didn't have to deal with the raider attack, which is real nice. That, that was very, very helpful. Oh, look at this. The towers are starting to come up. Oh, that reminds me. I wanted to change where we're actually doing our logging. So if we go to Emmer, we were chopping all this down. It's not a very big plot of land. I want to go for all this right down here, which is quite the distance for them to travel, but it's not horrible. So if we go just to the right in this area... Try and remember, right by this snow patch, quick, before it melts. Where's our lumber camp? Da -da 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 logging camp. Advanced. Work area. Yeah, all of this right down here. I think we can make it a bit smaller. Should be right here. So we'll get them logging all that up so we can clear out that space for some farming as well. Nice. And it looks like animals are starting to come back. Hopefully these guys will start doing some hunting soon. Yeah, they're still at the limit, so they're not going to do that. The berries are 
full on grown, which is wonderful. This is fully stocked. Everybody's harvesting. Uh, still not doing good on food. Our field, almost done being plowed. Crazy. These guys are doing some work. How's this looking? The wheat is 55% grown. I would imagine definitely this fall we're going to be able to harvest this. It's not going to be much, but hopefully it'll get it done. Oh, we have some money too. We need to get some chickens and stuff going on, right? We need some food. What's this? Do you have anything? You don't? Please get us some extra food. We need it so bad. Awesome. This field is done being plowed and sowed. It's going to growing. Our manor was just finished, which is nice. Awesome, we finally got that underway. Another family joined. That's cool. Oh, look at this. Not looking too bad. We have some defenses. Awesome. I could stop taxation, and I'm going to. Taxes, we're not doing it right now. Guys, I failed you as a leader. No taxes for right now. We need to rebuild ourselves. Awesome. So, this is growing. This is 57%. That's nice. I changed the priority, so the next one they should be doing is this up here. Which it looks like they should be starting the plow. Yeah, I'm not sure where they're all going. <laughs> Once they're done, I'm going to change the priorities to have these four fields at the very highest priority. Actually, we could just do that now. It's very high. This one will make very high. Very nice. Do, do, do. There we go. So those will all be very high. And then this one is wheat. So this one will be high, just for now, and we'll make this one high as well. I'm making this one medium, actually, so I want them all to focus on one field and then move on to the next. And then we should be good. Nice. And it looks like we have one whole month's worth of food. How nice. How nice is that? Ah, oh, boy. <laughs> it's a struggle. But I do think we'll be able to do this. We're going to persevere. Oh, uh, I did take a look at the battlefield too. I didn't see any bodies still over there where our battlefield is. Our memorial isn't built yet, but they're working on it. And this isn't finished being built yet as well. And I'm not going to run a road to it. I was thinking about going, having a road up to it, but it's not something you want to visit, is it? No, not really. Not at all. You know, I think it's about time we right a wrong here. We built this forager's hut all the way down here. And they have to walk so far to get to these berries. We need to, we need to fix this. It's, it's very important. Let's get a forager's hut up here all the way at the edge. It's going to look nice too. All the way down here. Oh, look at that, like nestled into the forest. That's going to look really nice. And we'll put a house next to it as well. Oh, the corpse bit was done. We finished constructing that. That's nice. I'm going to put this on very high priority as far as construction goes. Please get that done. As soon as it's done, we'll move all these families to there. It'll be great. And how are these fields coming along? This one is done and growing. This one is 62%. It's getting there. It's only April as well. That's real nice. Oh, look at this field. This field's getting there as well. Oh, this is so good. Things are coming up. More good news. We got another field completely sowed, or 98% sowed. I guess they didn't feel like finishing it. It's fine. I get that. They're all moving down to the next one. It's cool. You did good enough. That's still an A. That's still an A plus 
A plus farmers, good job. All right, so this one, how is this one looking? 64, it grows slow. It's slow growing. How is our new foragers hut coming along? Not at all, they haven't even touched it yet. I'm just too excited. I'm too excited to get things done and have things start moving. I'm also, I have a plan now of we're gonna save our money. We're not gonna buy any more chicken farms or I bought another vegetable plot right here off camera. We're gonna stop that and we're gonna get these war bows sold because we have four now and we only need, we don't need that many more to fill one entire group of uh, archers. So I want to start saving for that now so we could start selling those bows straight away. And we need, I think it was 60 in order to trade war bows. So yeah, we have to save up 60 so that we can do this trading route. And then we'll have tons of money to get tons of chickens and vegetables and all the other wonderful things that we need. Good stuff. We got families moving in. We have all of our fields are now finished. So we should be able to take some families off of this. Yeah, a lot of people are going home and stuff. Uh, I'm going to take... We'll take three off straight away. That'll give us some more people finishing this, which shouldn't take much longer at all. Uh, where did I want to put them? I want to put the logging camp. Yeah, let's get two families in there straight away. Helping out with that. And I think the only other thing we really want to do is we're still good on fuel. So, oh, we still have two people in the storage pit. Hmm. Okay. Um, I guess go gather stones. Or we can turn some more stuff into these tiles. That'll be good. We should still have a surplus of clay. Yeah, we do. 95. And we're selling it down to like 20. We have 31 gold, still have 30 to grow to go before we can start that uh, trade, which is good. And this is very close to being constructed. Oh, it's going to look nice out here. I like that. Let's put a house next to it straight away. We'll turn the priority down on the house, though, so that they don't build it straight away. We'll make this one... Not as big. This will be like a nice little cozy cottage. There you go. I like it. And we'll just turn the priority down on that a little bit. Nice. It looks like the forager's hut is finished. Good stuff. Alright, so we just want to take this forager's hut. There's four families. Get out of here. Sorry, guys. We're going to move you all up to here. It's going to be real nice. Oh, that'll be so much simple. Look at this. There's tons of berries to be had. And then this, is there anything still here? There's still two berries there. Let's see what happens to those berries. Maybe someone will come by to pick them up, I hope. And then we'll just demolish that. And we still have... Uh, we have a lot of people here not doing anything. And we should do something with them, right? Let's take two more families off of that. And we have one. Back to this. Let's put one gathering more clay. And we'll get one doing stone. We may as well. We don't want people sitting around doing nothing. We're not lazy here in Revilia. How are you guys doing? Nice. Look at that short distance. Looks like we have enough to afford that trading route. So we're going to do it straight away. May as well put our money into it. Let's go ahead. Establish that trade route. Nice. And we are going to export them. And we're only going to keep... Let's just keep 10 on hand. Right? Or how many is in a unit? There's 36, so maybe like 15. We'll get about half of the unit if we need to call one up straight away. That sounds good, right? So we do need to make a few more before we could start selling them. 
but we do have the means to sell them sometime soon. It's uh, it's still not that great. I thought it was going to be a lot better, but we have one dedicated family that's just pumping them out. So that's good stuff. And now that we spent that money, we can spend the rest of our money on getting some chicken coops and some vegetables and other stuff that we need. How are the berries doing? Not bad. Hey, They're already the starting to get some. Uh, this one, there's nothing inside, so we can just demolish this now. Awesome. And we could probably just put another home there, across from the granary. That'd be nice. Ooh, we just sold some more stuff. Good. How much is... what do you got? Can we... we'll at least get some vegetables. Why not? We need the food so bad. And our farms should be real close. 74, they're getting there. Ah, uh, things are moving along. Another thing I want to do real quick is upgrade this hitching post. So that we can get ourselves another ox. We're going to need it to pile these fields a little quicker and everything. And our construction people need something to do anyway. They finished building this beautiful little house down by the uh, farms. Which is nice. Fields still grown. I think it's like 70 something percent. And they should be... Ooh, this one's almost on down by the forager's hut. That's going to look nice. Ah, oh, this is fantastic. I can't wait until we start harvesting stuff. As soon as we start harvesting, we're going to pull the families off of these productions again and have them harvest it. And once we start getting some harvest in, then we're going to have to put families on the windmill to start making flour. And then once we actually have flour, then we'll put someone on the communal oven and we'll just go down the line and finally get this production started. Looks like the shrine to the first battle of Goldhoff is complete. Ah, oh, nice. That's so good. We should make a nice little road going up to this, right? For people to visit. How's it looking up there? We just connect. Oh, you could just connect right to it. Alright, cool. They'll probably be coming from here, so... We can just have a nice road coming up. Can we put a little bit of an angle on it? Hold on. Let's go up from this way. There we go. Nice. I like it. There we go. We have our memorial. Nice. <laughs> okay, so. <clears throat> I also, the field is 87. It's getting real close to being able to be plowed. I got us another chicken coop somewhere with some money that we raised. And we're finally good on food and fuel. Happy day. And there's still tons of berries. They're picking them real fast now that we move that. So things are looking good. Things are looking real good. We have 32 homes, only 28 families, so we don't really need to construct any more homes, but I still... I want to fill this little area where we destroyed our old forager's hut. We'll pretend that we didn't destroy the building, right? We just repurposed the building for a home. Why... Will it not let me build through that? What is this? Hold on. Is this just supplies? That is supplies. Okay. Can someone do something with that? Hopefully someone will be coming for that sometime soon. <laughs> that would be nice. I'd like to build a home there. Oh, look at this. Awesome. We're going to save up 20 to get another ox. That is really good. That's going to be very helpful. All right, we got some decent money in. Looks like we can get ourselves another ox. That's real nice. And how we doing? How we doing on the field? 95. Not bad. We have 32 homes, 27, 28, 29 families. 
We still have some extra homes. That's nice. I put somebody on fuel. So we're doing good on fuel and food now. That's real nice. Uh, the berries are gone. They're gone now in July. Okay. Uh, let's take some families off of this. We're going to leave just the one. And we're going to get ready for this. 96%. We have five builders at the moment. Did anybody move this? Oh look, it's gone now. We could build our home. Nice. Alright, let's build this plot. Right where that old building used to be. That looks nice. Awesome. <laughs> cool. It's like when you turn a warehouse into apartments, right? That's kind of what we're doing here. Awesome. Are we ready to harvest yet? I'm so impatient. 96 still. Jeez. Man, I'm just going nuts here. We made some money. I got, uh, we got chickens. We got chickens. We got more, more chickens. Building even more chickens right here. Guess what we're going to build? We got some more chickens. Do we have money left over? Do we have enough for... Oh, we're so close to getting some vegetables. That was a lot, though. Awesome. Did they finish building? Oh, no. They built one of the homes that I told them to. Oh, it must have been this one up here. Nice. They got that one done. Now they got to build this one. And there's still four more homes that they have to build. So the people in construction are doing well. I put another family on <laughs> making firewood. So we're doing good. With food and fuel, not terrible. I'm kind of bummed that that is gone already, but it's nice that it frees up so many people to do some harvesting. 2%! Oh, we're so close. All right, we finally did it. We're at 100% growth. It should hopefully be time to start harvesting now. We have four families doing construction. So we're going to leave just one family doing construction. All these people... They're praying. That's nice. They're waiting and praying. I'm not sure what they're waiting for, but ignore harvesting season. Yeah. Minimum crop growth. for. Okay. So I think we have to force an early harvest because it's only July and they won't do it. So let's do that. Force an early harvest. And harvesting. Yes, we have some people harvesting. Good. We have no construction at the moment. So while they get that started, where do we want to build another home? Um, let's see. We have this nice home out by the farms. We are going to have a lot of farmers. So it might be nice to have another farmhouse up there. But at the same time, I would like this to be a little bit more populated down here as well. So we may as well finish up this little bit in this little corner, right? Let's do that. We'll go out to about here, all the way up to the road. Is that good? I think I want to go up a little bit further. There we go. Have it line up with this other bit. Ooh, okay. I told some weird stuff. There we go. We'll just go right to there. Perfect. Nice. All right, we got some more homes for our construction people to construct. How many families do we need on this? We need three more families. So with stone, there's one and then two and three. Nice. Okay, we got our three families. Guys, get to work. Awesome. Gonna have them start to harvest this. Oh, I'm excited. I'm excited to finally have wheat production started. So good. With harvesting underway, I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode there. Joining one of our farmers walking down the path in a really cool looking hood. He's very stylish, that's real nice. He's gonna go and harvest us up some grain. As soon as we get some grain, we're going to take some families and start milling it in the flour and get bread production up and running. 
Ah, oh, it's so nice. I'm really enjoying this. I hope you guys are enjoying watching. If you are enjoying watching, hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel for more amazing videos. And I will see you guys in the next episode where we continue the adventure of Revilia. Bye!